Evacuating culinary school goes beyond just food for a group of refugee women. It's actually about starting a new life. Yeah, Tamara Vaipunua joins us now with their stories. Utah entrepreneur Lavanya Mahate understands how tough life can be in a new country. She's giving back by offering newcomers a place to learn skills, gain confidence, and find their voice. Building a new life in Utah. I come from Nepal in uh, 2009. I'm from Afghanistan. Was challenging. When I come here, I don't know how to speak any English. Years later, these women are prepping for a purpose at Rise Culinary Institute. RISE is a culinary institute that provides free hands-on culinary training to refugee women and immigrant women from low-income families. This is a passion project of Lavanya Mahate. Since settling in Utah in 2001, she has opened 10 Saffron Valley restaurants and now her first culinary school. It's so fulfilling, it's so heartwarming to see the kitchen come to fruition. Vanessa Trepalacios is from Colombia and loves to cook. Estoy como entre la comida de mar. She tells me, I like seafood and my daughter, she really likes chicken. So I feel like it's just a huge variety. I pretty much like to cook everything. Fatia Rahman has worked at a cookie factory and a store deli. After training at Rise, she's doing her own food catering. I love to like to share my traditional Afghan foods. Now, the goal is to get an internship and eventually land a job, but Mahate hopes these women will see their full potential. I hope that one day I have my own business. I'm owner of my business. It's definitely boosted their confidence and their ability to go out and create a career for themselves. Now, there's a special fundraiser happening tonight where you can help support more women who would like to sign up for this program. For more info, we'll put a link up on ksltv.com. For KSL News, I'm Tamara Vaifanua. It's a great story, Tamara, thank you. And you can see more stories just like this every weekday morning from 4.30 to 7 right here on KSL. And if you see something great going on in your community, let the KSL Today team know about it. Send them an email at lookingoutforgood at ksl.com.